And the other is something I really probably shouldn't tell you is that less than half a mile away from this very building was where I had my very first meaningful sexual experience. <laughs> and, uh, no, 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 please, no. No, it, it, it wasn't very good. <laughs> it never is when you're on your own. Um, anyway, as Steve said, a thank you to his wife. I want to say thank you to mine. Unfortunately, she's not here tonight. When I left her this morning, uh, I, I think she was in a coma, actually. Well, I, I think she was in a coma. Uh, sex was still the same, but the washing was piling up. And I... But, uh, uh, I would like to thank, apart from all the guys in Yes that I've worked with, my father, who played a massive part in my, uh, in my musical career. My, my family were all, all in the entertainment business. We genuinely were very, very poor. Um, my father was an Elvis impersonator. Uh, and, well, there wasn't much call for that in 1947. And he, uh, but he was, uh, he taught me a lot. I remember he sat me down once and said, son, he said, don't go to any of those really cheap, dirty, nasty, sleazy strip clubs, because if you do, you'll see something you shouldn't. So of course I went <laughs> and I saw my dad. <laughs> they, uh, they, uh, but I learned a lot. I'd, I'd like to thank the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame uh, very much uh, for inducting us. Uh, the only thing I, I would say, um, I'm glad that we're, we're actually up third because as you get older, you know, the old things like the prostate start acting up a bit <laughs> and the, the, the distance between comfort breaks gets less and less. Um, but I would like to say quite seriously how important it is to have have the old examination, which I had indeed on Monday. No, no, and for you, you ladies who don't know, it's really tough, you have to get in the old fetal position, you hear the old plastic glove go on, the rubber glove. And then it's like a gopher going on holiday inside your rectum. And, uh... No, I, while I was having my, uh... whilst I was having my examination, the doctor said to me, he said, Mr. Wakeman, he said, uh, there's no need to be embarrassed. It's not unusual to get an erection at this kind of procedure. <laughs> and uh, I said, I haven't got an erection. He said, I know, but I have. Uh, the, uh, thank you very much. God bless you. And I like... <laughs>